softening point of bitumen is the measure of its consistency. Softening point is a temperature at which bitumen will acquire a particular degree of softening. It is measured as the temperature at which a steel ball passes through the bitumen sample in a mold and falls through a height of 2.5 centimeter when heated under water at specified condition of the test. Let us see as how do we measure softening point of bitumen in laboratory. The apparatus commonly used to measure softening point is called ring and ball apparatus. It comprises of a metal frame having three plates. The top plate has a hole for insertion of thermometer. The middle plate has two slots for placing the rings and the bottom one is a flat. The distance between the bottom of the ring placed and the top surface of the bottom plate is 25 millimeters. The cylindrical ring is a tapered one and the diameter at top is 17.5 mm and its height is 6.4 mm. The centering guide has three pins such that they form an imaginary circle of diameter slightly larger than 7.5 mm to enable movement of the steel ball. The steel ball has diameter 7.5 mm and its weight is 3.5 gram. So, we shall require two each of steel ball, centering guide and the ring. The centering guide and ring fit each other and can be placed on the metal frame. In addition, we will require a heat resistant beaker of capacity 600 ml. A thermometer of range 120 degree centigrade and the accuracy not less than 0 0.5 degree centigrade. A hot plate connected through an energy regulator which is provided to regulate the rate of heating and a stirrer which is meant to maintain a uniform temperature in the bath. We would also require distilled water to act as heating medium. To begin with, bitumen is heated to a temperature between 75 to 100 degrees centigrade above its softening point. Simultaneously, take a glass plate, prepare a mix of glycerol and dextrin.
apply the mixture on the surface. This is done to avoid sticking of bitumen to the plate. When the bitumen has acquired desired consistency, pour the molten bitumen carefully in the ring. Allow it to cool for 30 minutes in air. If required, the excess bitumen can be removed using a hot sharp edged knife. Now we shall test the specimen such prepared. Put distilled water in the beaker. This distilled water is at a temperature of 5 degree centigrade and the beaker is filled to such a level that the surface is about 50 mm above the level of specimen. Now assemble the ring and ball guide. and place it on the metallic frame. Place the frame in water. And leave for 15 minutes. Now, after 15 minutes, we take the steel balls which have been previously cooled at a temperature of 5 degrees centigrade and place them on the top of the ball guide. Now place the assembly on the heating plate. Fix the stirrer. Switch on the hot plate and insert the thermometer. The heating should be done such a way that rate of increase of temperature is 5 degree per minute. Now we can control the rate using the energy regulator. Now, as the temperature rises, the bitumen will become softened and the steel ball under its own weight will start falling down.
note down the temperature when the ball along with the bitumen just touches the bottom surface of the plate. Similarly, note down the temperature for the other ball too. The average of the two is the softening point of bitumen. The difference between the two readings should not exceed 1 degree centigrade for temperature ranges between 40 to 60 degree centigrade and not more than 1.5 degree centigrade for ranges between 61 to 80 degree centigrade. If the difference between two readings is more, then the test should be repeated and values determined again. In this case, the value determined are 46 degree centigrade and 47 degree centigrade. Thus, the softening point of the sample is 46.5 degree centigrade. If the softening point is expected to be higher than 80 degree centigrade, then the test should be performed by using glycerin in place of water as heating medium and the starting temperature should be 35 degree centigrade. IS 73 has specified the ranges of softening point for various grades. These should be satisfied before using the bitumen for various road applications. Now, this sample which we have tested is of S 65 grade and the value determined is 46.5 degree centigrade, which is well within the prescribed limits. Therefore, we can conclude that the bitumen sample meets the criteria of softening point and can be used for rod construction. Determination of softening point helps us to know the temperature to which bitumen should be heated for various road applications. Thank you.